Men, men, there are people that are cold. There are people that have a calling over their life. But because a yoke is over them, they cannot see the anointing operate. When the enemy has put you under the yoke of agony, of destruction, even when you have a gift, you lose it in the thighs of a woman. Praise the name of Jesus. But a man like Joseph, his anointing cooperated. It, it made a room for him that he escaped the tricky and the cunning of Potiphar's wife. Why? There was a secret of anointing that was hovering over the man called Joseph. I speak an ordination in the night. Isaiah 61 verse 1. And the spirit of the Lord God is upon me. Because the Lord God has anointed me. To preach the good news. Let's repeat it. The spirit of the Lord God is upon me. Because the Lord has anointed me to preach. Child of God, it is in vain when you preach before anointing. Let me repeat it. You will always walk under a cross to heaven when you operate before you are anointed. Don't preach before the anointing. Don't cast a demon before the anointing. He said, the spirit of the Lord is upon me. The Bible said when Jesus entered into the temple, he was given a book, a scroll in the book of Luke. Chapter 4. The Bible said he caught it and opened. And he said, the Spirit of God is upon me. For God has anointed me to preach the good news to the poor. There, there is no way you can preach the good news before the anointing comes upon you. My prayer tonight, somebody shall receive anointing. 